It's beginning to look a lot like Christmas Everywhere you go Take a look at the five and ten It's glistening once again With candy canes and silver lanes that glow It's beginning to look a lot like Christmas I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands. One nation, under God. Indivisible. With liberty and justice for all. Good morning, RHS. I'm Lillian Corby. And I'm Addison Lewis. And this is your Daily Dose for Friday, December 9th, 2016. Senior, the University of Michigan-Dearborn will be hosting an on-site admission here at RHS next week, Thursday, December 15th. You can be accepted to U of M Dearborn on spot. If you're interested in this opportunity, please see Ms. Z in the CRC tomorrow to sign up. Have you bought your yearbook yet? If not, what are you waiting for? In a world where yearbooks are insanely expensive, one hero strives to get the best deal she can find. Follow her on her journey to save both a memory and $10. You're too late. Your deadline was Christmas Day. They're now $65. Yearbooks are on sale now through December 23rd for $55 in Miss Haddad's room, C119, or online at yearbookordercenter.com. Book prices will go up on December 25th, so don't miss your chance to hold on to these school memories for a lower price. Teddy's is selling this holiday season. They have Reese for $20 to $25. Poinsettias for $7 to $10. Christmas cacti for $5 to $10. Arrangements for $15 to $25. And homemade soaps and bath products. Don't forget to buy for your loved ones. The humans of RHS have been interviewing many students you may or may not know. Today we are taking a closer look on Hannah Daw. Sophomore Hannah Daw, the one that does theater, the one that does acapella, but there's more to hear than that. Where I felt most pride was probably like during this play that we just did because, you know, um, it's only my sophomore year and I did have a lot of lines and, you know, it felt good to get up there in front of that audience and it was, got to make some people laugh. I don't think there's just one person who makes me happiest. There's a lot of people in my life that make me really happy and I'm really grateful for all of my friends. They're great people. How I motivate myself is, you know, like when I'm trying to get through a rough time, I'll be like, I just have to get through today or I just have to get through this week and I'll be good. You know, I just have to get through it. That is just one human of Roosevelt High School. Remember, you never know someone's story until you ask. DECA will be hosting the Bear Den Takeover on Saturday, December 31st at Joe's Hammockers. There will be a special menu, photo booth, raffle, music, free New Year items given out, and more. The event will last from 11 a.m. to 4 p.m. See you there, Art Jess. On Monday, DECA will be holding a fundraiser at Buffalo Wild Wings in Southgate. 20% of your purchase will go to support our RHS DECA chapter. You will need a flyer. If you don't have one, you can ask for it in the post. Congratulations to the students who made it into Poetry Out Loud. If you haven't already seen, Mr. Baker for more information. Last year, Key Club donated a lot of food to our community. The class to beat is Mr. Makura's. The first hour with the most food collected will receive a breakfast with donuts, bagels, juice, and more. Key Club is hosting its annual Can Crush or Can Food Drive, which will be held today, December 8th through December 20th. Please bring canned goods or non-perishable food items. Your first hour teacher. Key Club members will collect the food on December 20th, and the first hour class with the largest collection will win a breakfast party. All donations will go to families here in Wyandotte. Thank you for your support. 
Now here's Carter Coyne with your daily sports report. Ho 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 RHS, I'm Carter Coyne and this is your daily sports report. Boys and girls bowling both won 30-0 on their last match. Hockey lost 3 to nothing to Divine Child Wednesday, but they also have an away game today versus Forest Hill Eastern at 8, and they also have an away game on Saturday against Mona Shores at 2. Boys freshman JV and varsity basketball have a game today away against Monroe at 4, 5.30, and 7 respectively. And girls freshman JV and varsity basketball have a home game on today against Southgate at 5.30 for freshman and JV and 7 for varsity. Now to Julia and Sarah about the ladies b-ball home opener on Friday. Hey RHS, do you have plans Friday night? We'll cancel them. Come check out the Lady Bears in our home opener against Southgate at 7 on Friday. Nothing can stop me, I'm all the way up. Watch us kick it off to a great season against Southgate. Can't wait to see them balling out this season. Hope to see you there on Friday. I've been Julia Dearest. Now back to the anchors. Thanks, Julia. Happy birthday to Trey Bartell, Kennedy Brown, Brianna Chilson, Samantha Grant, and Sophia Lawrence. Hey, Addison. How did snowmen get around? I don't know how. On their icicles. I've been Lillian Corby. And I've been Addison Lewis. Happy, Happy holidays, holidays, RHS. RHS. What's your favorite class? Um, probably AP Gov because why more is my boo. And why? <laughs> what hour do you have? Fifth hour. Is it interesting? Like, what's so interesting? Just. <laughs> <laughs> How does it differ from transferring over to the middle school to the high school? Uh, definitely as far as the. Uh... <laughs> Just kidding. Are you seriously? Is that all this was? A setup? It was. <laughs> What's your favorite class? Marketing. And why? Because it gave me the chance to do DECA. <laughs> What's your favorite class? Probably Auto Shop. <laughs> What's your favorite class? Auto Shop. And why? Um, because the teachers are the best there and it gives me a hands-on experience. <laughs> it's beginning to look a lot like Christmas. Everywhere you go